we see a catchy. Uh oh. They're already considered threats. President Okumura must be on guard. What with everything that's been in the news. That bastard. He's just causing more trouble for us. Oh, and I almost forgot about this. This is like the most hated palace because. There's this one part, it's like very confusing and frustrating. And I don't know if they changed it, they have to have changed it. A lot of people complain about it. I wonder if they changed the, the place where it's like confusing. And maybe, maybe they made it a little bit easier or they just removed it completely. I hope they removed it completely. But on the other hand, the music is pretty cool here. Also, I like the theme, the palace. Kind of weird though. One of them might be in here summer, yeah? Come on, we gotta go looking for him. Look at this place. Space. It's awesome. Holy, look, I think that's Earth over there. All of the other palaces I've seen out of this world, but this one's really in space. So, is that actually Earth? <laughs> Are we actually in space? Hey. What is this? Let's see here. Looks like a lever for the elevator to me. Right. And it should be working now. Real, you're amazing, Oracle. <laughs> that was nothing. It's certainly reassuring having you with us. Anyway, let's use the elevator. I wonder if I'm already over leveled. Because I feel like I am. What level? I think I'm level 40 something. Level 43 and on is level 42. Futaba is level 40. Well, Futaba doesn't fight, so she doesn't count. And that's how Akumura looks like. What's all that noise? What is that? Robots? There are tons of them. They all have the Big Bang Burger logo. They're saying something. You must adhere to your shifts. If you don't like it, you can quit. However, you will not be compensated. What are they talking about? Oh. They said it's being disposed of. These robots are part of Okumura's cognition, correct? That means they represent... This is pure speculation, but this is most likely how the workers of Okumura Foods are viewed by their CEO. So he thinks they're his robots? If they're treated like this in reality as well, then the company truly is exploiting them. See? Okumura is a piece of shit, just like I said! Mona is our main objective here. He doesn't seem to be anywhere nearby. Let's search further in. Damn it. I wonder what Smolny's doing here. We need to find him fast. Hold on a second, Joker. Why did you let me stop? We could have gone right past it. The door has been closed. Is there any other way by which we can open it? Performing biometric alteration. What does that mean? Alteration error. Only registered personnel may proceed past this point. The security system might be a bit of a problem. Look at it. There's no way we can force that thing open. We've hit a blockade quite early. But we have to control the real Okumura's cognition to pass. Oh, that means Mona hasn't been able to proceed any further either. So if he's here in the palace, he would have to be somewhere before this door. Halt, vigilante! <laughs> Who 
with that? I like bad girls, though. Are you the one who has been following us? Say something, damn it! <laughs> Enough of your misunderstandings. Mona! You're okay! Long time no see, Panther. Uh, hasn't been that long. If you came for the treasure, you should just go home with your tail between your legs. Actually, we were looking for you. The treasure will be taken by me, and this... This beauty thief! Beauty thief? I'll have you know she's a Persona user, too. My name is Beauty Thief! She really called herself that? Any tension that was in the air has just gone out the window. <laughs> yep. We will take the treasure! Ona already said that. You are not qualified to be phantom thieves. Do you even understand what it means to be a phantom thief? An admirable phantom thief is... Yeah, tell them! You! What do you think it means? That's no good, I say. just to say that. I don't know. Kind of feels like she ain't dangerous at all. We will take the treasure. You already said that. We don't have time to chat. <sighs> no point. It won't open. Don't underestimate us. Here they come. Huh? Snap out of it. We need to go. We'll meet up later at our usual spot. Let's hurry. Oh, hey. Bet you're tired. Uh, that was quite rough. I haven't felt exhaustion like this since I first awakened to my persona. What have you been looking at all this time? Sorry, I just didn't want to stand around and wait. The burglary at Okumura Foods is circulating the news again. Oh, damn it! Why'd they keep coming after only me? It's all because Little Miss Beauty Thief opened that door! That door most likely had a biometric authentication lock. So how'd she get it to open? I wonder who that girl could be. We were told that she's a Persona user, correct? Do you believe it's true? Well, she did look like one. Did Mona betray us? Yeah. I don't think he's betrayed us. If he had, it'd make more sense for him to directly threaten us, such as exposing our identities. Either way, how the hell's Morgana related to that beauty thief? Considering her tone and physique, she looked about our age. I feel like I've seen her somewhere. Oh, for real? Well, where at? At school, I think? Her hair is obvious. Wait, what? She had poofy hair. Fluffy. But now that you mention it, I feel like I've seen her too. And I think Haro has the best hair out of everybody in the Phantom Thieves. <laughs> is she a student of Shujin? Yusuke comes second. It's 
to that. <laughs> I just feel like that's the case. She did have a mask on after I like, all. I like Haru's hair because it looks like mine. <laughs> but mine's more much longer and crazy. The registry in the student council room has photos of every student. Let's check them all tomorrow. If we can figure out the identity of the beauty thief, that may help us regain contact with Morgana. Futaba and I should further probe into Okumura Foods, then. It'd be best if we investigate how sudden mental shutdowns are connected to them. We are gonna take them down. Gosh dang it. Stop calling me. We just talked like a few minutes ago. Things are really starting to heat up online. People are going on and on bashing on Kumara's foods. Apparently, they're basically using low quality ingredients brought in from overseas. Furthermore, any employees who were suspicious of Kumara were let go without reason. They coupled with the mysterious death of the rival company CEO. What's this all of a sudden? It's not going up in flames. I don't really get what's kicked it off though. People have been coming after us too. Do you think we should just hurry up and punish them? That's irresponsible. They're just acting like as spectators or something. It wasn't like this just a few days ago though. Could there perhaps have been a whistleblower from within? Come on, you got even more reason to take a, a Kumara down now. Can we really accept all of this information as truth though? Either way, we need to do something about where we gonna. Yup, anyway, see y'all tomorrow. Can I do something now? Gosh dang it, come on, please. Can I train? Fine. This is our opportunity. We could do whatever. Come on, Joker. Can I, I can't even go outside, but I'm gonna try. Nope. Akumar Fruits again. Did something happen? They're getting sued apparently. They're pretty shady. You mean how they screwed their employees for the sake of the profit? If he's that corrupt, then he deserves to be targeted. This is where the Phantom Thieves should come in. Yeah! Have you checked out the fan site? Akumar sits at the top of the list. Well, they see a big band burger? Why? Apparently they're really, uh, I don't know, crap to their employees. They, ne they never pay overtime yet. Ah, uh, worried people are hard enough that one actually died. I just heard that a pissed off former employee is the one who trashed their corporate entrance. There's a lot of terrible rumors about them, including that they're slung armed their competitors. Yikes, I just ate there yesterday. Never really thought about how they make so much food for so cheap. For so cheap. I hope nothing weird's mixed in. <laughs> ah, I just sneezed. Bless me. Was well, Sire normally called themselves Beauty Thief? I bet Morgana made her say it. Uh, it's still worth thing to say even if he told her to. Plus, they lie about her being able to use a persona too. We don't know if that's indeed a lie though. But we didn't see her use one. No matter how you slice it, she's totally just an amateur. Don't let your guard down. I don't think we gotta worry about that, dude. We can't take her lightly. She has Morgana on her side, remember? I agree with Futapa. At the very least, they're one step ahead of us. True, an amateur would not have been able to open the gate. They clearly figured out something we don't know. We need to uncover the identity of that masked girl. Oh! Man, this girl's hot! Ah, oh, but she's younger than me. So, the younger the better. Ryuji! I'm sorry, that was a bad joke. No way! She's the same age as me? She looks like my dad's friend. <laughs> Get back to work. Why don't we take a break? It's no surprise our concentration is waning. Even if it's only the female students, there are easily hundreds of them. They're all starting to look the same to me. Think we can really find her? 
<laughs> so many students. <laughs> you can say that again. Hmm? This girl! Haru Okumura. Wasn't the beauty thief like this too? Especially the fluffy hair. She has nice hair. That's gotta be her! It would also explain how she got past the door's biometric reader. This may be worth looking into. But why was she at the palace? We could just make her spill the beans herself. She may have already gone home for the day, so let's try tomorrow. I'm gonna lock up. I'll see you all tomorrow. This girl is Haru Okumura. Why would he make a girl push then? <laughs> you know she's not gonna be able to move then. You okay? Um, would you happen to be interested in gardening? Really? In that case, if you could help me unload this. Strong, thank you. You're a second year, aren't you? That makes me just a tad older. Um, have we met somewhere before? Oh, I haven't introduced myself yet. I'm Aru Okumura, correct? The only daughter of Kunikazu Okumura, CEO of Okumura Foods. Care to explain why you were inside your father's palace? Met. Wow, you figured it out in just a day! You looked really good in that biker gang outfit! Let's not talk about that. So, why did you become a phantom thief? <sighs> My father's highly regarded as a manager, but I had various doubts about him. Things have grown quite serious lately. That's why I want to make amends. Even though it may only be for my own satisfaction. But I wonder if this is just running from the problem. Where did you meet Morgana? It was pure coincidence. I found a lonely looking cat in front of our office building. And that was Morgana? Mm-hmm. And when I followed him, I ended up in the metaverse. There's no way for me to change my father's company. But if I became a phantom thief, I thought I'd at least be able to change him. Isn't there any way we can work together? I can't cooperate with people who don't know what they want to do. What you're doing is unnecessarily causing a stir among the public. Besides, the phantom thieves who should be helping the weak are not helping their own teammate. Uh, I just want my father to atone for his crimes and help Monachan who gave me a chance to do just that. But aren't our objectives the same? It'd be better if we were... No, thank you. I will do this with Monochan and him alone. She had quite a sore spot. We don't know what we want to do, huh? It seems getting her cooperation won't be possible. Let's consult with the others on our next move. We shouldn't ignore Morgana either. I'm home, Father. Drive them away. That's right. Make it a priority. Uh, I finally get a foothold into politics and this happens. Phantom thieves. Huh. Did the media ask you anything? No, not at all. Um, what's this about phantom thieves? It seems I'm ranked first on the forum of these so-called phantom thieves. Is it because of the news coverage? It's jealousy of the successful. Nothing but the barks of the masses who lack the resolve to sacrifice what's needed for their well-being. Both the young and the old are overjoyed with some foolish idols. This country has no future. What if they do exist? What if these phantom thieves really can steal hearts? Are you still having doubts about me? No. More importantly, I hope things are going well with that young man. Yes, father. 
very well then. He may not seem like it, but he's still the son of an influential politician. Be cordial with him. He'll eventually become a necessary connection for this company. Or rather, for me. I understand. I will do the best I can. Good. That's how a daughter of Okumura should be. Now that I'm thinking about it, I think Okumura might be a little bit better than Kaneshiro because Kaneshiro, nobody had a connection with him. He was just a mafia boss, that's it. Doing bad things. Okumura, one of their party members, yeah, she has a connection, which makes it a little bit better, but still this arc is still terrible. Oh shoot, I skipped it, my bad. Why are the fantasies um, letting him go? Well, you probably read it anyways. Why bother with rankings? Hurry up and take him out. I'm disappointed. What kind of heroes are they? Just get a move on and send the calling card already. No, I can do whatever I want. Hey, I found some weird comments on Mishima Kun's website. They were thick enough for resolving quests that we actually didn't complete. It's probably just a prank. But those requests are indeed resolved. So it must be going to mementos other than us. I think it's Morgana. I agree, he's probably taking the beauty through with him too. We should look into this. I was thinking of persuading Akuma-san at school, but she's been avoiding me. How are we gonna look into this then? We'll stake out mementos. Like a detective. Not sure how I feel about you saying that. I mean, we're the Phantom Thieves. The method is indeed a classic one, but it is for a safe bet. Yeah, I think it's better than just looking for them randomly. I'm gonna have all sorts of snacks. No teaching to stop me on a field trip. <laughs> well, we don't got uh, get over this with. Let's do it tomorrow. And I still cannot do stuff. I'll just add this. Look at all these days are being wasted. I can raise my staff, make some tools, but nope. I can raise all my things real quick. But no, I have to find Morgana first. Gosh dang it. Believe it. Is it a little strange that Akuma's the top of the row of the fan site? I mean, there are tons of companies that do the same thing. Maybe they're singling him out for all the, the praise he gets. Besides, there are a bunch of strange rumors sur starting to surf about his company. Oh, you mean like that stuff happening to his competitors? Does tell me you buy the occult BS. I'm sure it's a coincidence. Worn out from your trip? Come on, you're young. Hawaii doesn't even count as going as a foreign country. And full of Japanese tourists. I bet you were just able to speak Japanese wherever you weren't. went, weren't you? The sh shopkeepers will use Japanese to pursue to buying things as their life depends on it. I'm used to this bit though, so I usually haggle with them in English. Mr. Kurusuku, show me how much you know your English. Oh, I know a lot. Let's hear it. What's one of your supposed origins with the phrase cat got your tongue? Oh, okay, easy. <laughs> Wild cats with no mouth, cat eating tongues, a cat, a breed of cat with no tongue. Huh. This one. Yep, knew it. This is it. Good. In ancient Egypt, it said that the tongues of liars are blasphemers were cut off and fed to cats. It's also possible it came from a pirates. pirates. Cat on nine tails. Cat on nine tails. Leaving a prisoner too stung to talk. There are probably there are, oh my gosh, I cannot read. There are actually a lot of other expressions involving cats. A cat has nine lives, for instance. That relates to how cats seem capable of I was surveying all kinds of dangers, even ones you expect to kill them. Yeah, cats know what they're doing. They get out of situations that seem impossible. And cats are really smart too. Man, it's crazy how many people wanted to change the heart of the Kumara Food CEO. I mean, duh. He was doing tons of shady stuff. It sounds like everyone is betting us to actually take him down. 
Come on, we gotta do this. I don't feel like it. Why not? You're fine when I <laughs> just lay him down? That aside, does everyone remember the plans for today? Yes, we were told to stake out our mementos. You think they're gonna show? We'll just have to wait until they do. For real? Can we just go back until we make up with Morgana? I'm sure they'll come. Hope you're right. And this is where the stupid part comes in. You're going to apologize when Mona comes, alright? I know already. And why are you just saying that to me? We need to be wary of the beauty thief too. So we're doing a stakeout here. We better be ready for the long haul. Ain't he gonna show up today? I mean, what time is it now? Hold that thought. You guys are seriously slacking off way too much. Do you have business with us? Aren't you fulfilling the requests on the Phantom Aficionado website? Even leaving comments? It'd be best if you don't accept them so recklessly. The police will track you down in no time. If that were to happen, we'd be caught up in it as well. Uh, that's not what I intended. But that would be my fault. Uh, I'm actually not that great with machines. I'm truly sorry. Why are you apologizing? They're telling us for our sake. We should be thanking them. Won't you please put what happened behind us? So I'm the one you're here for? You guys need me after all? Is that it? Really? Ryuji! We're sorry too, Morgana. We weren't taking your feelings into consideration at all. Lady on. Shouldn't you be using code names? Ryuji didn't really mean what he said, you know? He wants to apologize. Well, it's like... It was my bad, too. I mean, I don't mind if you're not human or if you're useless. What a douche. Han's setup was completely ruined. Oh, is that right? So I am just some useless cat to you guys. You're so full of yourselves, but do you have the skills to back that up? Try and catch me then. Get in, beauty thief. You can't do this. Don't count on me ever coming back. There they go. Did he even think about how long he made us wait? Fine, we'll do this. Jeez, this isn't what we came here to do. And yeah, this is the part, the most dumb part. All right. Look, there he is. We need to go after him and talk things through. Oh my goodness. Thanks a lot, Ryuji. Th thanks a lot. I I'm let me just get in your face. Hey, what are you doing? Let me get in your face. Ryuji, stand still. Let me get in your face. Thanks a lot, okay? Thank you very much. Okay, that's enough. That was getting really, really creepy there. I think he was actually liking it. Okay, but I'm gonna end the video off here. And let me say a brief moment. Okay, the first part was fine. You understand, we're gonna be feeling useless. And then this part, absolutely terrible. And we're not even done with it yet. Now we had to chase after them. And I'll see you guys later. If you enjoyed the video, give a like, please, subscribe if you haven't, and show me next time more Persona 5 Royale videos or any other so, uh, I upload. And I hope you have a nice day too. And I'll see you later. Bye.